Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But now, let's get right in today's topic, which is regarding Mill Lady Meme Coin. We're going to be analyzing the charts, see what is happening today as of May 23rd, and what is yet to come for this project. If you guys are liking these updates, you guys are enjoying, um, you know, continue liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I will continue making these updates for you guys. So if we're looking at the price right now, guys, still about seven zeros and front of the price right now currently sitting at 47132 down once again another 14 percent in the last 24 hours in usd comparative and 15 percent in both bitcoin and ethereum comparative over the last 24 hours looking at its market cap currently sitting at 42 million dollars and the 24 hour trading volume is half of its market cap currently sitting at 19 million dollars so let's shift our focus uh you know of course to the price but before we do that you guys know we have to look at the overall followers and followers are still increasing that is a good sign and the holders you guys can see there is a decrease and you know it shouldn't surprise anyone right now because we are seeing a massive sell-off happening which we were projecting in my other updates for you guys about mill lady and it is really causing a snowball effect that you know i've been talking about and snowball effect is a real thing you know people really don't un you know tend to understand what a snowball effect is it really is you know a real thing when it comes to meme coins and even other altcoins you know when a massive whale or you know massive you know amounts of a certain coin is dumped on the market there generally is a panic that comes right after that so you know other people start panicking and you know that becomes a massive snowball effect and that's what we have seen happen with ladies and if you watched my other updates um over the past Past few days you know i was saying there's a chance that ladies can drop to the prices and that's exactly what has happened you know not everyone uh, likes to hear that of course everyone wants to see moon left and right but you know there's going to be times where people will end up taking profits you know manipulation will happen whales will try to manipulate the coin and that is what we have seen happen with the ladies but now we're going to get more into depth with the charts you know we'll talk more about the price because everyone at the end of the day is here for the price as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so Looking at its market cap, it's currently sitting at 41.6 million to be exact. And, you know, it has a liquidity just on Uniswap alone at about 1.5 mil over the past 24 hours, which is, again, not a bad thing. But now we will zoom a little bit further into the charts and see what is happening and what could potentially happen as we do go further into the week. So if we're looking at what's happening, you guys can see, of course, it's no secret at this point that, you know, this project has been in a downwards channel over the past few, you know, weeks, uh, I mean, week and a half. So, you know, from, um, you know, that wick that we did see above that level of resistance back on May 17th, we have seen a retracement of about 60%. And, you know, things really got bad after we broke below this level of support, which is at that 6505 cents mark. And we project that that could uh, be the plan i said you know we could be retesting the may 12th prices and we're literally very very close to the may 12th prices right now and now comes the question you know that's on everyone's mind you know is this absolutely the end for mill lady right now like could this be uh, the end are we about to break below this you know if we go below this level of support then you know i would think you know we are about to see more panic of course coming in but right now guys this is you know a very very critical price level for ladies to hold you guys can see this support line of course did play out for us when we did see the initial all-time high dip happen and you know of course we did see a beautiful rally happen right after that so you know people think people were thinking around here that you know ladies was dead you know people were thinking around this range that ladies was a dead coin but you know it went on its way to making you know a move of about 3x shortly after and now you know one positive thing that a lot of people tend to forget is these are low cap coins and these low cap coins do generally pump up quite faster compared to large cap coins you know it's easier to pump these coins and you know when the hype factor really comes on them things can really get exciting so what really caused this downwards trend happening for ladies you know of course you know i went into depth on this in one of my videos where i said you know 
there's a blacklisting thing going on that you know they're blacklisting big wallets and i shared with you guys my personal opinion on that and i said if that really is the case you know if these uh, developers are hearing my video you know i want you guys to know i'm gonna be straightforward it does not matter it does not matter at all you know if someone is holding millions of worth of your coin uh you know if they bought in early if they bought in early they have every single right to sell those coins and should not be blacklisted but at the same time sometimes these people have malicious um you know thoughts you know they want uh, the coin to fail and if certain projects or devs have the proof then sure you know it makes sense but you know what this is doing a lot of people are saying is that you know it is causing investors to look elsewhere because hey you know why would they invest in a coin that you know potentially could be blacklisted you know i think we want we need the dev the developers the team to really come out and speak more about this you know of course uh look on chain has posted that you know they have blacklisted this but we do need more information in terms of this for us to really see what happens so now comes the question you know the question of the hour the question of the moment is this the end for mill ladies i don't think this is the end for this coin you know it has shown us its strength it has shown us its you know hype factor and you know this is a meme coin at the end of the day guys remember all these big exchanges are coming and listing this because they do see the value that this could bring in the short medium term as i've said to you guys from the beginning you know meme coins are extremely risky 99.9 percent .9 of them will end up failing i've said this in every single video so you know if you are really worrying after you know investing in a meme coin and that is the biggest red flag on your end because you have invested too much that you cannot afford to lose look at all these coins they have a similar pattern they will dump quite fast uh, but you know it depends on the overall community you know what we need to be looking at is exchange interest the community interest it's all still there and if we're looking at all the big boys right now they all have a similar pattern because the king which is pepe is still on a sideways momentum which is causing you know uh, a lot of you know shakiness a lot of downwards momentum happening within the price of you know you can see bob for instance you can see um you know what's another one uh ben you know it did really good recently and there was some deal that came out or something like that but you there's a vojack you name it all of these coins have a similar pattern right now and um you know i believe this is just the beginning of this meme coin mini i think it's going to be way bigger and i think these big players that have already built such a you know hype and a community with them or will be the ones that will be successful in this cycle and i do have high bets high bets on mill lady being a top performer but you know of course time is going to tell but you know everything speaks for itself you know the exchange listings uh the community interest elon musk that's the biggest one and i've said this from the beginning elon musk tweeting just that picture alone took mill ladies to where it has been so um you know of course that is um, a massive factor and people are still thinking that you know he could potentially come and list that uh, you know list it or you know tweet it again and of course you know what that would do but right now we are sitting at some very important levels of support we did see a bounce from here before so could we potentially see that happen again i would not be surprised if that were to happen but we need to see this support hold if it doesn't you know we could see more downwards momentum but i don't know there's something telling me that you know mill ladies will bounce from this range but again of course time is going to tell always do lock in profits when you're seeing these profits i cannot stress this enough imagine to the people that were here just a week ago and you know they were sitting at some crazy gains and they did not lock the profits in you know and i was giving you guys a heads up every single video you know lock those profits in you do not want someone else coming and locking those profits in before you and some people listen some don't but at the end of the day everyone has the right to do what they want Want. but that's the current uh, analysis on mill ladies of course i will keep you guys updated if anything were to happen but i do believe that you know we should be supported by this range um unless you know bitcoin does take a significant drop within its price and if i bring out the measuring tool for you guys in order for us to retest that level of resistance that is still a move of about roughly a hundred percent now so 2x from the current price levels but i would love to know your thoughts down below in the comment section where you could see the price of mill ladies going you know there's going to be a huge fight as to who is going to be the next uh, pepe that hasn't been decided yet
you know, we've seen coins that have reached hundred million dollar market valuation, you know, uh, 120, 200, but nothing has really gone close to that level yet. And I think that's where the excitement begins. And now everyone is on the hunt for the next ones. You know, some have built massive communities and now these are going to fight with one another to really get to that spot. And we will see what happens. But this is my current take on here. Uh, let me know down below your personal thoughts. And yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow. And it's been CryptoZX and peace out.